I'm very drunk. I am very, very. I am. I am very drunk. I am drunk. drunk. I like how it wears off quickly. I'll go pick a fight with somebody. I know, right? Kind of perfect. I am drunk very now, right? Wait, it's in there? Oh, is it? Is it under? Oh. Uh, ooh. Nice door. Okay, now we're going to there and then. So I think they should have made this game just a Viking hack and slash looter. Didn't really need to have anything to do with the Creed IMO. I, I think that, you know, if they tie it in, interestingly. Maybe it'll be a really cool Creed game. We'll see. It all depends on how they tie it in. I think it's a little bit too early to say that. Since we don't really know what direction they're going with it yet. Is this game ever going to come to Steam? Uh, it's on Epic right now. Need to get on the other side. But, um... I'm pretty sure, help me out here, chat. I think the other Assassin's Creed's are on Steam, maybe? I don't, I don't know. Someone, someone will have to. Someone will have to. They are. Okay. So in that case, I would say probably eventually. Most of the, the Epic stuff is generally for like six months or a year, the deals. So. I don't know which one. Creed is. Yep, Yakuza tomorrow. Yes, Epic does need Uplay. So if you if you don't like Epic, you can just get it on Uplay directly if you'd rather do that as well. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Whatever you want to do. What about Switch? I don't know. Anything else? No, we're good. Old pillow? What did I just put that in my pants? Okay. <laughs> ball of yarn. I get the most random stuff. Like, why do I even pick this stuff up? Oh, look, it's a ball of yarn. I'll need that. Oh, look, it's an old pillow. Gotta take it. Uh, let's go see what this is. What's the story of the Animus so far? We've only had a tiny glimpse of anything Animus related, and it was basically right before we picked the uh, the gender of our character. You can pick either male or female, or there's this system where it like switches between the two based on, on the strength of the signal at the time. Don't know what that means. Um, and the only thing you really hear is like the, the Animus technician people talking to each other a little bit, like, you know, which one do you want to go? One's stronger than the other. So there, there hasn't really been any connection outside of that yet. Yeah. I hate the Animus parts of these games. Oh, I love the Animus parts of these games. The Desmond arc in the in the first stuff was one of my favorite parts of this game. Desmond. I will say that that I really enjoyed the Desmond arc, but there's no question that I feel like after that, they got a little bit more sloppy with it. 
Like, I, I thought the Desmond stuff was really cool. I am cool. lost and honor bound. And, um, and then after that one got to its conclusion. I feel I am going um, round and round. There hasn't really... The, the Desmond one's been you the best. You arrived without a sound. Are you a scald? I've never heard poetry shouted in this way. A scald? Oh, no, not at all. I am truly looking for honor and have become lost as a result. You're looking for honor here? It's a bit remote. I am the seventh son of a seventh son. I am expected to bring great honor to my family. But everything has been done. My uncles and brothers have all had great victories, or even greater deaths. There's nothing left for me to do. The gods have been deaf to my pleas, but you are here. So you want a great victory from me, or a great death? No! I want to live, and I could not possibly hope to win against you. That is true. But maybe you could lead me to a victory. I can tell by looking at you, you're not a great warrior. You know it too. There's no reason to deny this. I could bring you a chance at honor. An animal of some kind. Something you could handle. Yes, yes. Like a that rabbit? I could add a few details. Nothing too exaggerated. Skulls do it all the time. So now you're a skull. Do not go anywhere. I will only do this once. I will be here. On my honor. What am I doing no, right now? Let me... Let, yo, where's that elk at? <laughs> Um, oh, God. Oh, that's why I get those little slowdowns. It's an animal attacking, I think. Oh god, you fast. Right. Oh man. I'm gonna laugh my ass off when we bring this bear over and it just like Now win your honor. They are much bigger up close. <laughs> I do not think I can do this. I do not think I can do this! Come, Mel. Honor calls. Let's drive away, Jim. Come on, man! Hey! You got it! You happy? Did we get it? I did it! What an incredible fight! You got a few stabs in. How was your first kill? Gods! I have never felt so alive! My Hooger soars on Hooger. Raven's wings! With this rebirth comes a new name. From this day, you will be called Hell and Bearbane. Terror of the Caves. It suits me. You know, now that I think about it, I think my story should be told in verse. Farewell, Beast Beta. Hell and Bearbane! Hear my that was pretty good. I like that one. Roll back into your deep dark cave.
That was kind of fun. Wait, is he gonna go get killed? Where, where are you going? Corpse. Oh, that's pretty wild. I want this one. I want Assassin's Cantrip. Well, actually, I kind of want to see what the other options are. We can reset our skills whenever you want, so. Man, this looks, it looks big. Huh. I really like the assassination route that we're going. Let's see what this is. Oh. Auto loot. Well, I know where we're going first. Yup. Good talk. Good talk. And this place is full of loot. Look at this. Oh, oh, it's a big guy. He's got loot on him. On his poison. I should be cautious around here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You just saw me? Oh, that guy. Wait, did he fall out and die? No. I had that parry. Spoilers. I didn't. <laughs> I didn't have the parry. The more and more I see of this game, the more and more it just looks awful. Yeah. I, I think it's pretty standard Assassin's Creed stuff so far. It does seem to have some AI issues, though. So. I'm pretty sure that guy actually fell out of the tower. I think that dude fell out of the tower. Which is hilarious. You are all these. 
you. Maybe I gotta do the uh, little targeting thing first. Oh, that's what happened. We could have shot out the platform. I wonder how that happened before. She pro I was under it and she shot at me and broke her own platform. I'm like 90% sure that's what happened. Because I certainly didn't do anything. And nobody would have shot up there. I'm pretty sure that's what happened. That's hilarious. Case closed. That's right. Case closed. Mystery solved. That NPC is more co than co? Okay now. Hot shot. Slow down. Okay, chain assassinate is gonna be like a no-brainer. Yeah, th we'll definitely be keeping that skill. I like the idea of silently killing somebody with a throwing axe. It's just, that's just kind of great. A freaking throwing axe. Oh wait, wait, let's try the whistle thing. Why does it sound silly that you kill someone with a throwing axe? It just seems like there's better options is all. It's just like a, an axe is kind of like a big brutal weapon. Hey guys, couple couple quick notes to say in chat. Um, because we got a lot of new people in here. You know, we got 23,000 people in here. A couple things. Um, first of all, we've been, this community has been around a long time. So, we here in this channel don't um, mind when people have negative, negative things to say about the games that we play. Just fine. Um, it, that is okay. So, if people don't like the game, that's all right. Now, if you want to state that you don't like the game, it's much better to be like, man, I don't like this game because, and then put something like insightful or cool or, you know, something that shows a little bit of thought instead of just being like, man, this game is shitty, which is fine. I mean, you can do that and you're welcome to your opinion, but it's just, it's a little better to have like a little bit of a thought in your comment. Now, that being said, that being said, uh, we do love discussion, but at the same time, don't feel the need to defend the game. That's that's the point of and, and why I, I wanted to say this. Don't feel the need if somebody says this game is bad to like defend the game. It's okay. People people can have their opinions. It doesn't mean that 
You know, your opinion is any less valid. Um, and uh, it, it's okay for people not to like the game. It's totally okay. So, you know, I see some people in chat that are kind of, it, it looks like they're kind of getting personally offended because folks aren't really digging this. And you just don't need to be. It's fine. Like, I'm having fun with it. You can have fun with it. People can hate it. Whatever. It's cool. Um, you know, just keep in mind that it, it doesn't say anything about you if somebody doesn't like the game. That's all. Wow. Okay. Well. Yeah, I'm having a good time with it. It's uh, it, it's an Assassin's Creed game. I, I don't really feel like it's it's rewriting the Assassin's Creed formula. Um, it's a little bit more aggressive. It's got some fun mechanics. It does have some issues, some AI stuff, and been a few bugs and things like that. But overall, I'm liking it. I'm, I'm I, you know, it's 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 I'm liking this a lot better than I did Watch Dogs Legion. I'll tell you that. That's for sure. So that's cool. Father. Check out this weapon. Mm -hmm. oh, we need to go see if we can upgrade some weapons. Speed 80. Oh wow, this thing is this thing is fast fast. Oh look at that. Oh, that's a that's a that's a lot of stabbing going on there. That's a whole bunch of stab man, that's a long ass combo. How many hits was that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh my lord, dude. The stabbery is real. See ya. Toe is now Captain Stabbing. Oh, I'll take it. Alright, uh. I don't, I don't have an opinion, just more of a question. Is Assassin's Creed still much like the original ones? No. Hey, Good talk. Okay, but no, uh, to, to put it bluntly, um, Assassin's Creed, especially over the last few, um, Assassin's Creed, especially over the last few entries has, has pretty dramatically changed in the way, the way that it's, it's working. Um, before Assassin's Creed used to be about blending in, one-hit kills, not being discovered. Um, but with Origin, they kind of started flipping it on its head a little bit. So now you have like, you know, full statted inventory, tons of different gear. Um, there's resources and harvesting, and there's even like like crafting elements, a lot more action-oriented combat, um, where in the previous Assassin's Creed things, it was all about like, parry, kill, parry, kill. Like this is, this is a much more developed Kind of, it's more like an action RPG now instead of a stealth RPG. Um, it's a little bit more of like a, an RPG heavy action game than it than it is like a, a stealth kill game. Yeah. Hope that makes sense. Was it really an RPG in the first place? That's true. That's true. It, it definitely started as like an action stealth game more than anything. Mm -hmm. Now, granted, that being said, you can play this game similar to the way you would play the first game, but it's clearly no longer the only focus. It's become much broader in terms of, of what it allows a player to do. And in some cases even encourages. Let's go get this last little piece. I think it's at the top of that tower there. Change is good. Yeah, I mean, it's certainly can be. I, I'm, I mean, I, I like the direction setting in. Oh, I thought I had that. Stab, 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 stab. Whoa! Whoa! My man, slow down. Here we go. Come on, 
me. Oh, you, oh, you're still alive, damn son. Get out of here. Let's stretch the knee thing. Trying to get the parry timing down a little bit. Stuff feels like so viscerally like use them. Definitely like it. Remember to See, with that move, for instance, you get the special ability to peek under the water a little bit. Pretty cool. <laughs> I'm just using one of the finishers. Yeah, I, I don't know if you can pick your finisher. Maybe it's like what weapon you're using or something. First time I've tried to shoot at somebody that's auto targeted. Felt a little odd. No escape! I will get you! The gods won't want you! Lawyer, uh, Laurel, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate that, dude. Take you. Oh, it's above us. Go meet your dog. Have scum. Hell yeah, buddy. Just a couple more days. You and your damn rope, chat. Can you turn off the numbers damage in this game? Hey. Okay. Pretty sure you can. Let me let me double check. Um. Fight damage numbers right there. You can turn off a lot of stuff, actually. Mm -hmm. Third party. MSI Mystic Light, Kobe Eye Technology, Interaction at Gaze, Lock Target at Gaze. Oh, that's kind of cool. Huh. So you could look at stuff and it will target it? Okay, I think that's all we need is here. Let's do this real quick. Let's see you, old friend. Can I mark? Oh, I can. Look at that. Oh, I can't mark him, though. Can I? Does that move with him? Cool. Okay, so we can totally mark people. Mark people, that is. 
Um, I think we're done here. Got a lot of good loot. I want to see what this is. What the hell is this doing over here? Uh, let's see if we can summon our boat. I haven't done that yet. 